What up guys, Fox City Vapes, just a quick update. Um, I picked up a new toy. Um, this is a DNA 30 clone uh, by Tobacco. It uh, goes all the way from 7 to 30 watts in 0.1 watt increments. And it does, I don't know if it, my, my thing's over here. Uh, is that the right way? No, that's upside down. Shit. But right now I got a set of 30 watts. Got a 1.2 ohm coil in here. And uh, I'm not really into sub ohming yet, but I do have this uh, Sigeli SIGAS rebuildable atomizer on it. I am rocking a 1.0 to 1.1 ohm, depends on. Um, this uh, chip is reading it. Uh, differently every time I turn it on. It's probably because it's a clone of the DNA 30 and it's just not going to read it uh, completely accurate every time. But um, let me show you how it uh, how it chucks. Let me just so it's a little dry. Let me just throw some juice on there. Um, the juice I'm using right now is. Um, sorry, it's a free sample, and it's, they did tell me that it was 6% alcohol, uh, alcohol, 6% nicotine, and it's, um, 60% VG, 40% PG. It's just a little bit thicker than what I usually use in my tank. Um, I usually use 50-50 in my tank, but, uh... This is called Smurfs Blood. I think it's called Flavor Town Vapes, is the name of the company. Smurf Blood is kind of like a blueberry slash blue raspberry type of flavor. It's really nice. Let's get this nice and moist because vaping this friggin' thing at 30 watts is fucking. It'll go through some juice. As you can see, I'm burned through almost this whole. Well, this is 15 mils right now. Uh, but let's we'll see how she puts it off. Oh, is it locked? There it goes. As you can see, it fires up pretty nice. Um, I was going to ask the guy. This thing it says that this thing's supposed to the DNA thirty is supposed to fire down to a 0.3 ohm coil. I don't really foresee myself needing to go down to a 0.3 or as of right now. Let me show you why. As you can see, it's a one ohm coil. It's chucking pretty good, and the flavor is nice. Uh, I really, I really do like my uh, my Nautilus Mini on my Tesla Spider. I use this as my like all day type of vape. Excuse my phone. <laughs> going off like crazy but uh, like I was saying I really do like my Nautilus Mini with its uh, 1.8 ohm uh, BBC coil and it's a uh, bottom vertical coil in the clear miser down there um, I use this as my all day vape it lasts me all day this one I use when I'm out at the, cl out at the club or bar or if I'm just sitting around the house and I feel like chucking. This goes through a lot more um, liquid. A lot more, as you can see. I mean, it's freaking fucking chucks it. Um, uh, <clears throat> I might try to see. I got some Canthal coming in the mail. So, uh, 26 gauge. 26 gauge. Um, I'm going to try to do some, uh, some different builds. And... Uh, I'm probably gonna record myself doing the build, so you know if it turns out fine, I'll put it up on my channel. But my first, my first build is probably gonna turn out like shit. So uh, I'm gonna start off with like micro coils. I might, I might do a macro coil. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if you can see that's a micro coil in there. I don't think I have too much more room to do uh, to do uh, bigger coils. So uh, yeah. I'm probably gonna stick with micro coils, nano coils, 
I might, because this has a three post three post design, I might see about doing a uh, a sleeper coil, but I know that sleeper coils are um, a little bit of a pain in the ass to build, so I might wait on that for a little while. Um, you know, like I said, this is just a quick update, and uh, so far I'm liking my new toy, and uh, I'm still off cigarettes, so plus, right? Let's just hit this one more time. And the vapor's not as dense. I know I noticed on this um Sigilly Sigilly Sig S mod or mod um RDA. I noticed on this RDA the um the uh air holes. I don't know if you can see them, but the air holes on both sides it's fixed. There's no air hole control. There's no adjustable airflow. Which some people might gripe about, but for me, um I like the fact that it's wide open all the time. Who the fuck is that? Nobody. Uh, <clears throat> I like the fact that it's wide open all the time just because uh, I am just now getting into um, rebuildables. And I don't. I'm, my, my throat's not quite used to the, uh, the, the, the warmth yet. So I like an airier draw. So. Um, I'm going to leave you guys, uh, if you like this video, hit the subscribe button down there, leave a comment, anything that you want me to review, any juices or anything like that, I do have a couple of juice reviews coming out, including this uh, Smurf Blood, and I have Blue Dew coming soon, by the Vapor Hut, and then while I still have a little bit left, I'm going to do, I think it's called Vapor Monkey. And it's uh, orangutan. It's kind of like a citrusy orange kind of flavor. So I've got a couple different juice reviews coming out for you pretty soon. So uh, yeah, hit the subscribe button, like this uh, video, shoot me a comment, anything you want me to change, anything you want me to do, and uh, yeah, vape on guys. Let's get smoking out of this country.